Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Donnie's Donuts here, and this is game two of the the conference finals between the Geezers and Bear Down. Is the Bear Down going to force the game three, or will the Geezers move on to the Potter Cup finals for the first time in franchise history? As welcome to Pollock Stadium in Toronto, Ontario, for game two of the best of three conference finals and we're getting get the start like always and Grady says in the other end as um, n as the geezers have a chance to move on to the Potter Cup finals for the first time in their franchise history they've been around since season one but just hasn't having gotten this far yet as here we go we're underway as they score already oh my goodness 21 seconds in. Keith Roy makes a 1-0 geezers. Oh my. First shot. And it's 1-0. As I was just about to say, we're underway here in Pollock Stadium, Toronto, Ontario. And it's 1-0. 21 seconds in. And so the bar down are trailing already. Big hit from Chara. As this game's just started on an early goal from Ryan. As there's looking for more. Blocked. Loose. Save. I was saying that, yeah, they haven't been moved on since. They haven't moved on this far. They made the conference final. Actually, no, no, they haven't. The farthest they made it was the second round. Never made it this far. So... They have a chance here to move on to the finals. And they could they have to either play the Pacers or Jungle Gyms as game three is next between that series. We'll, we'll find out who uh, who's going to move on in that one. As, uh, unless I'll do game three after this if it's necessary for this series. So, yeah. So... The geezers or pacers or jungle gyms are barred down. Here we go. As here comes Lindsay now in. Oh, he just got to dump it in. No real pressure so far from the bar down. They're down the series. They got to do something. As Newell dumps that in, and now they'll get a, now they'll chase after. But great job by the bar down to get that out. Here comes Pollock. He's got speed in Lindsay. Great job by Sul Ross Sullivan to get get. Back. And here comes Newell in now. Over! Oh, that was off a stick and still almost went in. Now here comes Yamamoto the other way. Lindsay got space. In Pollock! Save! On the post as Ed Dyke covers that up. Does not cross the goal line. Somehow, that stayed out. As the bear down, their first great chance of the hockey game. And now... Uh, now, yeah, model got him pinned in. Now, Pollock blocked right out. Here co here they come in. Wade gets it in front. Chera. Oh, he can't get a shot away. He gets it back. Shoots. Save. They get it back again. And a block by Pollock. Now, he got that puck. Gets hit there, and they keep it in. In they come. Shoots. Say, Just got a piece of that. They can't. They're hemmed in their own zone. Newell's got that down low. In Ross Sullivan gets stopped. Now they get it again. Oh, great job by Pollock to hit him off. Now here comes Jesse Pollock. He goes in now. Cross to Yamamoto. He can't get a shot away. He kept his goal streak going. Can he keep? Can he try and get his team somehow back in the series? As oh, that's just off. Sorry, he would have had a breakaway. Six nothing are the shots. They still didn't get a shot though. So the geezer's in control, just like game one. It's just a repeat. Blocked as though he broke his stick though. But Pollock grabs that beyond the net. But no, it's off the broken stick. Save. Oh, what are the chances of that? And they could not get it out. It went off the broken stick and stopped the puck. And it didn't go out, so Markow gets that draw, but they get it again in the Geezers. Another chance! I think that hit off a stick and wide. Now here comes Pollock, got it. Up to Yamamoto, gets dropped. 
And now here they come back in front. No, great job by Markow. And now here comes Ted Lindsay, gets it up. And now Pollock got space in front. Oh, he can't get it. It's that only goal at the 21 seconds into the game it separates us. One nothing, one nothing series or one nothing goal, one nothing game. There we go. As now they take it now, Mark Howe dumps that in. As now Yamamoto in, in, again. As now big hit there. Here comes Getzlaff in Ryan. Oh, off the post. Oh my glorious chance there. And now beyond the net, gets hit. Fish is hit. And now, but. They gain control. Here comes Polak. Got Yamamoto with him. Yamamoto, great job by gets up, but he gets it back. Yamamoto up to the point. Chilebri walks in. Lindsay! Oh, giveaway! Scores! Jesse Polak has tied the game at one. That is huge. As a giveaway in front. And it's one to one. Here comes Ryan in front. Oh, gets left. Just almost gave their team the lead back, but he just missed the net. Now here comes Mark Howe. Gets it up. Now Yamamoto goes into over Lindsay. Oh, that's off a stick. And now Chara right up the middle to Steve Newell. He's got a backtrack, and he's getting chased by Yamamoto though. But great, he somehow got that to Ross Sullivan. He's beyond the net. He's going to try and go up, but gets hit. Here, now Yamamoto grabs that puck, gets it over. Now they'll cycle it around. Big hit on Pollock. As now here comes Ryan in now. Ryan back pass to Getzlaff. Shoots! What a glove save! He robbed him. Oh my, what a save! As 9 to 2 of the shots for the geezers. They're just all over them in this series so far. Now, scores! Steve Newell gives the team the 2 1 lead. What a play off the faceoff. As Oh My get, gets that pass it back to Sullivan, which gets it over to Newell. And it's 2 to 1 as they're back up in front. As the Geese are just in control of this game, they've been the better team in the series so far. So, yeah, we'll s but their goalie's been playing well. Bar down. In front scores! Yamamoto has tied the game back up! What a pass from the corner! Oh my, that is huge for the bar down. 54.4 seconds left. A, a late goal, but now here comes Ryan. Tries to shoot a great job by Chalebre. Now here comes Polak. He's got speed. Shoots. Save. But he gets it back. Lindsay back. To, they don't got much room. Big hit, and that's going to end this period. As a 2 2 tie after one. As the bar down scored one late, and now the geezers gain control, and now gets left. Almost turned it over, but now up to center, gets it up to Ryan. Here they come in now. Get new in! What a save! And now back to the point. There he he hasn't pinned up the boards, and now here they come. Mark Howe gets laid into by Sullivan. Oh my, what a hit. Oh my, even bigger hit. Almost got hit into his own bench. And now Yamamoto gets hit. Just a physical, starts out physical. Oh my, what big hits. And now Getzlaff grabs that loose puck. In front, Newell, what a save. And now down low, gets poked away. But Newell gets one-timer. Oh, what a save by Sass. Ryan gets robbed. Oh my goodness, Is the geezers had early chances, but the goalie says no. One-timer scores! This time, they beat him right off the draw. Steve Newell gets his second in the game. That, after all the chances, and then finally they beat him. As now, the bar down are back down by one. And now here they come. Yamamoto gets hit off the puck. 
right down in the geezer zone gets Newell gets hit down low battling for a pile up in the corner who's got that oh my goodness still loose as they finally get it out what a sequence there just a pile up there and now in front save rebound another save oh my the geezers had a chance to go up by two they get it again gets left tried to get it over to Ryan didn't work and now up to center here comes Yamamoto over the line just backhands it and then look for a rebound or something as now they they're as the geezers get it back and now here comes gets left around Celebre gets left goes in the zone he gets it one timer what a stick check is now he didn't get all of that and now here comes Lindsay over center ice but now gets poked and Yamamoto go tries again Lindsay in what a save by Dyke now in front oh he can't get it <clears throat> and now here comes Newell has Getzlaff with him in front oh great job by Celebre but now Polak's getting chased there how grab it oh what a turnover but better save by Sass oh my that was a bad turnover by the bar down as the geezers just in the right position every time and just forcing those turnovers and now here comes Polak. He's got a backtrack. Gets it up. Now here they come in now. Polak gets it over. Chlebre saved by Dyke. <clears throat> what a action. But most of it was, is in the bar down zone though. So the bar down going to try and do something to stop this onslaught of offense the geezers are throwing at them just throwing everything but the kitchen sink at them right now and now here come the bar down Pollock that gets poked off and now here comes Newell Newell beats him nice pass to get slapped blocker save as the goalie just playing so good right now so far oh my goodness is Steve Newell going on a rampage just hitting a lot of a lot of the pe players and now down low Ryan in front Newell backhands it loose puck Pollock finally gets that out just a crazy period so far and now Pollock gets pinned up against the boards by Sullivan he gets that puck and now here come the geese again as the Newell goes beats him as oh great poke by Celebre but now in a board battle again oh big hit from Ryan and now tried to get it back. Polak grabs that loose puck. And now here comes Howe. Gets it across to Lindsay. Shoots. Look for rebound. Oh, save there. And now over. Tried to get it over. Lindsay down low. In front. Oh, what a save. Oh, my. And a boar battle now. Out. Blocked. Oh, my. Is now here comes Sullivan. He's got speed. In over. A save by Sez. Yamamoto gets hit there. And now Newell has to go back all the way down to his, in, his own zone. Newell gets it again. Now Sullivan grabs it up. And now here they come. Again, Newell goes in. Cross ice there. Now here they come. Two on one. Shoots. Save. What a great save that was. It's just the geezers are throwing everything at him, like I said. And now back. Now over. What a save again. And now down low. Who's got that gets left does? Big hit there. And now here comes Pollock. Pollock goes in now. Pollock waits. Over. Lindsay shoots. Plat pad save. As one as one minute remaining in this period, windmill deep back to Sullivan. Great save again. Glove save. As their goalie just keeping them in this game right now. Pollock, nice move. Glove save by Dyke, and that's going to end this crazy second period. As what a second period that was, but only one goal to show for Ryan. It scores as right as fast. This is faster than the early goal in the first period. This time it's 18 seconds in. Keith Ryan goes bar down after all the chances in the second period. Their first shot in the third. It's a goal. As is four, two geezers. They needed that. 
and now they're closer. They could taste it to the Potter Cup Finals. But now, you know, the Bear Down won't take that lightly. Here comes Pollock. Shoots! Saved by Ed Dyke. And now Newell gets hit the gets hit there but Sullivan gets it up here they come Ryan back to Chera back to Sullivan scores Ross Sullivan second shot second goal in this third period is five two geezers oh my two quick goals in this third as the geezers have a three goal lead they just got to shut this down right now and then they'll be moving on, but here comes Yamamoto, breakaway, saved by Ed Dyke, what a save that was. As Yamamoto gets robbed, and that could be, they're, they, they gotta show a last gasp here, they're, they're, sh they're losing by three, they gotta try and do something, oh, down from the corner, Right to the goal of the great. He says to cover that up again. <clears throat> as four minutes in, already two goals from the geezers early. As now Chara shoots, misses, and now gets it up. Here comes Pollock. He's got room. He's in. Scores! Jesse Pollock beats Ed Dyke. It's 5 3. Anything's possible. As they scored one, as they, they need two more. Second in the game for Jesse Pola. And now Getzlaff beats him wide. In comes Getzlaff. Over! Oh, great job. Now in from Ryan. Gets it back to Chara. Shoots! Rebound! Scores! What work! As Newell gets the goal back. It's 6 3 by 3 6 3 geezers. He just got that shot off as the geezers take a 6-3 lead as now Sullivan in the corner battling for it. oh who's got that now Polak goes in oh tried to get off the pad and now offensive zone face off as I made a mistake in game one guys the bear down actually have been here in the conference finals this was season six so I actually put that on YouTube I don't know how I can't remember that but they did, but they did, but they got swept by the Houdans. Now this time the Geezers are here and could and are on the brink again of being swept by the Geezers. It's down 6-3, not much time to go, or not all, during the third period. Down 6-3 with 13 minutes to go. Now back Sullivan tried to get it down low, great poke, but they can't get it out. Gets laugh, gets it over to Newell, back to the point to Chara, Sullivan. Now they're cycling it around now but great job by Lindsay here comes Lindsay he's got room shoots save <clears throat> and now here comes Ryan the other way Ryan gets hit there by by Celebre and now now Lindsay's got room gets oh but that's offside as you can be shown there's been a lot of desperate plays from the bar down as they're down they gotta try and do something to get back in this game. As now down low. Now Pollock grabs that but gets it right back to Newell. And now here comes Sullivan. Cross a long stretch pass to Getzlaff. Getzlaff walks in. Shoots! Oh, he just missed that net. Now down low. Now working for it. Now, oh my goodness. Hit from behind. Getzlaff off the post. Oh, that could have been a chance to really put this game to rest. And now back, Cherry in. Oh, pad, toe, save. As the crowd approved of that, but they got to try and do something to help him try and get back in this game. Is now down low, but Cherry takes that beyond the neck. Great job by the geese in this period. And now Newell has that puck back to Ryan. Back to the point. Down. Oh, great chest save. As 7.55 left to go. As now they win it. As now down low to how he gets hit there. And now again. But now they can't get a big hit. Oh my, what a hit there. Now down low. Gets it out front. Oh, he can't get it there. And now here they come. Here comes Celebre down the ice. Oh, the Yamamoto. 
but save down the six to go. They got to try and do something here. Here they come. They pull the goalie already. And now down to Markow. Down low, Lindsay gets hit by Sullivan. He's got control with the empty net down there. Ross Sullivan's going to carry it up. Blocked by Celebre. Oh, that's a save by him. And now big hit. Oh, Myers now gets left. Empty net. And the geezers are going to move on to the Potter Cup Finals for their first time in their franchise history. As they're just on a magical run right now. As the geezers are going to move on. As oh my, just a frustrated bar down team just took a penalty. As the geezers got a power play as 7-3. The geezers, they must be jubilant right now. They haven't been this far ever. As we'll s this should be a good finals either the it's gonna be either the geezers or pace. It's gonna be the geezers or and either the jungle gyms and or pacers. As imagine the as out in front, they score again on the power play, and now it's eight to three. Oh my! As they just add salt to the to the wound, as. 8-3 to three for the geezers as imagine well it could be a chance for the jungle gyms to get there for the first time just and then then no one will have experience in the finals if the if that happens so although Ryan and Dyke have been there before and Sullivan he's been there before and and Conroy so they've been there before once so the other t as the geese kind of got of a disadvantage they haven't been here before they even had the chance to live the the dream of the finals live the atmosphere the fans just it's a different feel for the finals isn't it it's a different feel to it it's just from the regular playoffs just louder better atmosphere just better everything the finals is just you're one step closer. You're so close to the finals, even, or you're so close to the cup. <clears throat> you seem to win two games. As Yamamoto saved by Ed Dyke, as you're so close to the cup. As yep, there it is. Well, Ryan can add two more. He's tied with Yamamoto now, 18 goals. No, Yamamoto is up. No, has 19 goals. Z scored this game he's kept his goal streak alive he's just had a great playoff just cannot as the bar downs magical Cinderella run will end right here as the geezers just they've been they've been great this playoffs they beat the Houdans for the first time or for the first time in their history and the Houdans this that was their first first round exit first like First uh, loss in the first three rounds. They've always made the finals. This time it's going to be different teams in it. As oh my. As the Geezers. Fan, Geezers fans get on your feet. Because the Geezers will move on to the Potter Cup Finals. For the first time in their franchise history. As they all go to celebrate with Ed Dyke, their goaltender, as the geezers move on to the Potter Cup Finals. <clears throat> as the bear down Cinderella run ends here right now. As they made a far, they got nothing to be ashamed of. They made it so far. They're the second wild card team. Less, last team to make it as they made it this far. Yep, they'll go grab the trophy and they're not going to touch it. As the geezers, they need two more wins. So, guys, I'll see you in game three of the Pacers and Jungle Gyms. And we'll see who's going to meet the geezers in the finals. So, 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video and this series. And I'll see you in the in game three of the Pacers and Gyms.